Hi, welcome back. Uh, this is Mohammed Jello from JumlaSultan.com. Today I'm going to show you how to create menu items in Joomla. Okay. Now, if you go to our homepage, uh, you notice that we already have menu categories. We have the main menu. This is the top menu here, and uh, this is the resources menu. This is the key concepts menu, and then if you log in, you find out that we have the user menu. Okay. All these are met, uh, categories of menu that we have. Okay, so let's go back to the admin area and click on menu manager. Now, these are the categories of menu that we have, okay, which I just showed you uh, from the front end. Now, if you want to create a new menu item, okay, uh, let's say, for example, here uh, under the main menu category now you click on this this is main menu here so click on this graphic here and now there are two ways you can do this you can either rename an existing menu and make it point to a particular content section or category or you could create an, a fresh menu item by click on new okay so first uh, let's create a new Let's rename a new menu item. Now we want this to point to a particular section of our website. Okay, so uh, now remember that we're creating a recipe website. So we want this to point to one of the sections of our website. So first we have to change the type of menu. Now this is still going to be an internal link, and we want it to under articles here. We want to point to a particular section of our website. So, section layout. Okay, now let's choose the section that we want uh, this menu to point to. So, click on this, let's call it our uh, Hispanic recipes. Okay, so uh, we want this to point to the Hispanic recipes sec section of content on our website. Okay, so once it's all down, come back here, and you want this if it's advisable uh, that you tweak this a little bit here. So you can say you want this uh, category list and sections. Okay, once you click on that particular menu, it goes and then lists the uh, categories in that section also. And if you want to show certain categories on in that section that doesn't have any content in it, you could do that. Click on show. If you don't want to show, if you don't want to show any content categories that doesn't have content, just click on hide, which is advisable. Okay, and then click on the parameters. Now under the advanced parameters here, it asks you the ordering that you want. I uh, prefer to make it alphabetical and then the ordering of articles also make it alphabetical also and you could choose any of the other options that you have here so you'll be ordering all the categories under that section alphabetically and then all the articles under each category alphabetically also and then you want to be able to create an RSS feed for that section okay so you click on yes and then the components parameter here you have to fix that also. Uh, if you want to show unauthorized links, say no. Show the link, the, the article title, say yes. Is the title linkable? Yes. Intro text, show some intro text. And then the section name, show the name of the section. And make it linkable. Show the category. And make it linkable. Okay. If you want to show your name also, you could choose that also. If you want to hide it, you could do that. It's all up to you. And then the time and date that a particular article was created. You can choose to hide it. Just to hide where you modified it also. Navigation, you could show the navigation. And then if you want to enable voting on an article, you could say yes. And people will be able to rate and vote any article under this section here. And then you have this icon show up. The PDF icon where people could convert an article on your website or the print icon, email icon, 
you know, and all that. Once all is done, uh, choose the system parameters and give and name it after the year. Uh, this is gonna appear in the title bar of uh, your window when you open that section. So it's gonna be Hispanic recipes. Okay. This will be also be a uh, ranking, you know, in the search engines for that particular keyword. Okay, so once all is done, click on save. Okay, now as you can see, Joomla overview has now been replaced with Hispanic recipes. Okay, so now we go back to our homepage and see if we were actually able to do this. So refresh. And here we have Hispanic recipes, so let's click on it. Okay, so we have uh, Hispanic recipes, and on that we have different the, the other subcategories are uh, the, the categories that we have under that section. We have Mexican recipes, and then we have the CMS and the community. Okay, now if you look at the title bar, you know we have it here. It's Hispanic recipes also, and then you know so it's pretty. And you have it in the uh, okay. So okay. Now another way of creating a menu item in Joomla is to create a new one instead of renaming. So let's assume that we want to link to uh, another menu item. We want to link to a particular page or website. So what we do is. And we want to create a new menu item, so click on new. Okay, and then choose. Uh, let's assume we want to link to an external website. Okay, so choose external link. Let's give it a name. Let's say so. Uh, more recipes. Okay, and then the link. Choose a uh, put in the web page. The URL of the link that uh, you are pointing to. Okay, example in Jamla Sultan. This is an as an example, and then no parameters to fill out here. So just click on save. Now, as you can see here, we now have uh, we should have a new menu item here more recipes okay and it's a URL so let's go back to our homepage refresh and uh, there we have it more recipes so if you click on this it should open you know a new link so let's click on that so it automatically goes to The, the website that we link to uh, while creating that particular menu. Okay, so th those are two ways to create menu. You can either rename, rename it like we did here, or create a, a fresh menu item by uh, going to the top right hand corner, click on new, and following the uh, instructions. Okay, that's how to create menu items, and uh, I'll be uploading some other videos and other aspects of using Joomla. Thank you very much and I wish you all the best. This is uh, Muhammad Jello from Jumla Sultan.